Hi guys, my name is Gloria James Girl and welcome to a brand new Sims 4 series. I am so, so excited about this. We're going to do Sims 4 Vampires. Now I know Vampires has been out for maybe seven months or so, something like that. But I have not played it at all. In fact, I have not played The Sims 4 for possibly about 12 months. We have been full-time travelling around Asia, so I haven't had a PC for the last 12 months. And I don't know, I just haven't really played it on my Mac or whatever. So I'm so excited to get into this. I have created this sim. She is called Crystal Winters. And we're just going to take a little look at it before we get started. So obviously her aspiration, she wants to be a master vampire of course and she's a quick learner her traits are that she is cheerful outgoing and self-assured this is her everyday outfit we'll just go through her different outfits so you can see them this is her everyday outfit and then we have her formal outfit very posh i love this dress actually it's so beautiful and then her athletic gear as this one her sleep attire that one her party are very nice i like this dress i've never seen this dress before in fact actually with the vampires there is some pretty cool i'm not going to click on them now but there are some pretty cool uh, new outfits that probably as we progress through we'll probably mix up and change her outfit because we're not actually starting it off as a vampire we're starting it off just as a normal human being i don't really know anything about the whole vampire pack to be honest but i think that I do know that you can get bitten and then become a vampire so that is what is going to happen hopefully to our crystal and then her swimwear is just this plain blue i do need to go and get some cc i think for my sims because i haven't got any at all but for now we've just working with what we have got and let's go ahead and start the game so obviously as we're going to be focusing on the vampires we are going to go to forgotten hollow which is the new world that you get with the vampire pack so we've got well three pre-built houses one that we can build our own house and then we've just got this one widow shield town home whoa it's a registered vampire lair wow what does that mean it's a registered vampire lair that costs 90 we are gonna be broke we're gonna have like no money left but i don't want to buy this and build our own house so we're just gonna move in here this is gonna take me a while to get used to i was never very good at controlling the sims but this is gonna take me a while to get used to it again so let's have a little look at our house what have we got here it's actually it's not a bad little starter home in all fairness oh we've gone straight for the book what are we doing read lucas dark and the increasingly unlikely series of coincidences so i don't know in terms of a job or anything i don't think i'm going to get her a job at the moment i i mean i don't know whether there's something new in the way that vampires can earn money or anything like that i have literally no clue um maybe did she just no i thought she just dropped that book on the floor okay she clearly likes reading She's reading the first unicorn. Not a bad idea at all. Let's go and take a look upstairs. This is actually a really nice little house. I'm not a fan of the green toilet and sink, but it will do for now. It's not so bad. We should probably maybe go out, should we, and explore? Or can we... Because mm, we need to get bitten. And so we won't get bitten if we just stay in our house. Let's take a look at the area. Wow. Amazing. I want like a big, huge vampire house like that. Are these, is this the welcome wagon people coming to visit me? Maybe. I wonder if any of these are vampires. No, they're the, uh, yeah, Dominic Friars. I feel like I can maybe learn about vampires on the computer or something. I feel like that's, yeah, look, vampire secrets. Search for information on vampires. So let's take a little look, see if we can find out any information. Oh, look, her, um, oh, level up, wow. Crystal has researched, I missed that. Uh, she's delving deep into researching vampires. There seems to be a lot of knowledge she could unlock if she continues to research. Okay, that's good. 
this goes really really quick look how fast that green bar is going up oh look so down here so use a computer to search for information we've done that we need to read encyclopedia vampirica volume one that is leveling up so fast let's go and welcome or say hello oh caleb is he a vampire he looks pretty much like a vampire oh unlocked vampire tome crystal has discovered the von flavius vampire emporium while searching for vampires she can now purchase encyclopedia vampirica volume one on the computer under vampire secrets this guy must be a vampire surely let's make friends with him uh let's get to know him confess fear it's gone now we're not scared of vampires i don't think let's discuss his interests what are you interested in what is his name i've completely forgotten caleb oh acquired the charisma skill do you want to come in caleb he definitely looks like a vampire praise vampire lifestyle make vampire pun let's praise the vampire lifestyle like what makes a vampire bite you just like i don't know whether you have to do something particular to get them to bite you or whether like, i don't know will they just bite you when they feel like it i'm sure we'll find out should we invite him in? Does he want to come inside? Invite neighbours in. He's definitely a vampire. Look at him. We're getting along well. This is going good. They could be great friends. Oh no, he wants to go. Well, I think it's time to be going. See you around. No! I wanted you to come inside. Stay and talk to me. Can we hug? Oh, do we know each other enough to hug? Um, let's hug. <laughs> See if he likes that or not. Crystal is outgoing. Outgoing seems need to socialise more often. Yes, we know. Did, it was the hug okay? Yeah, the hug was fine. Um, let's give him a compliment, because I really would like him to stay around. I want to be his friend. I feel like maybe he could teach me lots about the vampire life, if he is a vampire. I'm assuming he is. He's coming inside. Yes. We want him to be inside. That's it, Caleb. Come in. Um, let's in views about vampires to him see if he will open up and confess that he's a vampire possibly oh no look at the spider web down there and like the coffee stains or whatever that is on the wall oh i really like it maybe though now we should read that vampirica volume oh purchase vampire what are vampire tomes tomes have we got the book that we need or do we need to i think we need to purchase it don't we the um we have like not really got enough money to be purchasing things but uh, a game of groans it was encyclopedia of something it's not here because this is alphabetical order isn't it what was it that we had to read hang on let's come out of that and read encyclopedia vampirica volume one where is encyclopedia oh hang on do we need to oh okay vampire tomes that is what they are we need to purchase volume one how much is that going to cost 75 yikes that's expensive okay but we need to buy it so we will just get it and it goes into infantry okay so let's get out of her infantry and let's read it she needs to find out as much as she can about vampires because he is not helping out at all how do we get bit somebody like if we don't get bit in this episode somebody let me know down in the comments do we need to do something in particular to get bit because i have no clue let's have a look become a vampire 
Discover a vampire sim and become friends with that vampire. If you get in their good graces, they may ask you to become a vampire. Oh, so maybe they don't. I thought they did bite you, but maybe they don't. Maybe uh, if we... Become, yeah, we need to be, like keep talking to this guy then, Caleb, because he could maybe turn Crystal into a vampire if we get in his good graces, which is definitely what we want to happen. Okay, let's stop reading for now. Coffins keep out all sunlight when closed. Crystal can do something useful with that bit of info. Where are you going, Caleb? We want to talk to you. I don't know anything more about vampires. Oh, you don't know anything Speak more? I thought you were. Am I talking to the wrong person? Are you not actually a vampire? <laughs> Maybe we need to wait till night time. And that's when the vampires come out. Uh, debate existence. Let's debate existence and see if he says. Oh, I am a vampire. They definitely exist. They're talking about vampires. Did you see that pop up then? Okay, that I don't feel like that really helped us. Where did I put that book? Oh, I just dropped it on the floor. Let's continue reading it. I feel like maybe night time is the best option. I'm sure that he is a vampire. Hey! No put that down i was gonna oh he was tidying up thanks there was no need to do that though because i was gonna read it but okay thanks anyway um read it look at his earring i like his earring <laughs> we're just constantly thinking about vampires she's becoming obsessed she has a vampire obsession Maybe I should, I was going to say maybe I should go and have a little look outside, but if I um, think that vampires, when they come out in the day, I'm pretty sure that they die. So, oh, discover plasma packs. Crystal discovered that there is an alternative method for vampires to satisfy their thirst. She can now order plasma packs on the computer. We're not even a vampire and we can do all of that. Okay. Let's, um... Yeah, no, what I was saying was that, yeah, there's no going to be no vampires out in the day because they will die. We definitely need to wait until the night time if this guy isn't. And maybe they only bite you at night time. I don't know. I feel like, okay, let's cook something. We'll make some grilled cheese. Uh, we'll do a family size serving because I feel like there's not much point making. I'd normally like always make loads. Oh. Crystal read that low-level vampires can be trained by high-level ones. Cool. Yeah, because vampires don't eat the normal food that Sims eat, I don't think, from what I can remember. So, there is no need to have a lot of food in the house if she is going to become a vampire pretty soon. She just throws that book down when she's finished. Okay, I will clean it up. It's okay. Is he actually going to go? Oh, no, he's not. Oh, I really should get going now. He's gone. Are you wanted to like oh no now we're gonna have to make friends with someone else or hope that lots of vampires come out when it's night time is it obvious do you think who's a vampire that dude definitely is he's got to be let's make our food and then maybe we should go to the toilet and sort of prepare ourselves for going out later on because we'll go out in the evening i think okay she has finished eating and gone to the toilet it's just turned night time so i say we go out somewhere i don't know where maybe like a nightclub or something oh, i don't know i don't know whether best just hanging around the neighborhood because like this is the vampire neighborhood i suppose But there's not very many people here, so maybe we should, yeah, we should go out somewhere. Let's see, actually, if Caleb wants to come somewhere with us. That could be a good idea. Stop reading the book. And organise where we're going. Right, we are over at the Blue Velvet Nightclub. And, yeah, we'll just kind of see what happens. Oh, look, we can ask to turn. Should we ask him to turn us? 
I feel like we should, seeing as... Yeah, let's. Let's get into a vampire. Oh my goodness. Okay, hopefully the option is still there. Oh no! It's not there! Dang it. Um... Oh yeah, there we go. Okay. Ask to turn. Let's ask him to turn us and see what he says or what he does. This is exciting. Is he gonna do it? Um, hey, can you turn me into a vampire? What's he gonna say? Oh! <gasps> Whoa! Is he doing it? Oh my goodness! <gasps> He's biting us! Oh my goodness! What na- what? Oh, we have to suck his blood? Oh wow! Okay, we're feeling pretty uncomfortable now. I'm not surprised. Strangely hungry from a weird feeling. We are a vampire. Oh, no, we're not a vampire yet, are we? We've just been bitten, but it takes a while to turn to a vampire, I believe. So, yeah, maybe like a few days or so. I'm not entirely sure. But we have just been bitten. I'm so excited. So so excited for this i think i'm gonna go ahead and end it here but thank you so so much for watching i hope you are looking forward to this sims 4 vampire series as much as i am if you are looking forward to it if you enjoyed the video go ahead and give it a thumbs up subscribe if you're new to the channel and click the notification button so you get a notification of when i upload a new video and i will see you guys soon bye